Do you need me to make another ice machine run? You know, there's some wounds that ice can't heal. <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> you, ha you have to admit, that was a pretty cheesy line. <laughs> you know, you have a really strange way of apologizing. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just, we've been working through this all night, and I think I'm starting to lose it. <laughs> Look, you know how I truly feel. You also know me better than anyone else. I made a stupid decision to protect you when we were kids, and it just kept escalating from there. I wanted to tell you so many times, but it got harder and harder, especially when you started leaving the tickets. I couldn't bring myself to take that away from you. It would be like you finding out that America's Next Top hand model was fixed. Wait, is it? Did you hear something? <laughs> no. I was just using that as an example. <sighs> Okay, because I don't think I could handle that right now. I think I always knew deep down that it was all too good to be true, that I'd never meet them, but I guess a part of me wanted to believe that maybe something bigger would come out of all of this, that it wasn't just about action figures or championships or entertaining millions of people, that it would help me find a part of myself that was missing. But maybe something bigger did come out of all of this. This wasn't about finding two people who would fill a hole in your life. It was about millions of people finding you to fill holes in their lives. <laughs> <laughs> now that was cheesy. <laughs> but it's true. <laughs> Maybe. I have something for you. Please don't tell me this is a letter from my long lost aunt and uncle telling me to forgive my best friend. Just open it. What's this all about? It's our new list. On one of my ice machine runs, or maybe it was one of the times you locked me out of the room, I can't remember, but I made some phone calls to management, and it's unprecedented, but they've agreed to let us get revenge on Brooklyn and Samoa Joe at tomorrow night's WrestleMania. Assuming you're on board. I guess we're coming out of retirement. This has to be some kind of record. <laughs> There's one other thing you need to know. Brooklyn and Samoa Joe agreed to the match, but only if we put our Hall of Fame spots on the line. You really want to do this? If we don't fight back after what they did, then we don't deserve those spots. Package deal. I'm in. Hey, just wanted to let you know, I left two open seats in the audience just like you always did. Why? I mean, obviously my birth parents aren't showing up anytime soon. So was it just for good luck or out of respect or something? You'll see. <laughs> 